Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you a really cool trick in which I'm going to predict the outcome. So first of all, let's start with a pen and a piece of paper in which I'm going to write something. And I'm going to take this piece of paper and keep it right here so that it's visible for the entirety of this video and it's a proof that I haven't tampered with it. So let me go ahead and think of a random four digit number, something like 3589. And generally I'd ask someone else to give me a second random number, but since I have nobody, what I've done is I've taken a deck of cards and I've removed the face cards from it. So I only have aces through 10 and they're gonna act as my random digits, except that 10 is gonna act like a zero. So let me go ahead and shuffle it and take like four random cards out of it. So my first number is gonna be 7425, a 7425. So let me go ahead and write that down, 7425, right? And it's my turn again, so let me think of something else. Something like 2574. So it's your turn again. So go ahead and shuffle these again. And let me select some four digits again. So my number is going to be 271. Nine, a two seven one nine, a two seven one nine. So it's my turn again. So let me just put um, seven two eight zero. So uh, until now, we just have five four digit numbers, two are random, three I just selected out of my mind, right? So Go ahead and pause this video and calculate the sum of these five numbers right here. So once you've done that, let me pull this paper out and so is that the sum that you calculated? Pretty cool, right? So how to predict what random numbers will finally sum to? It's actually pretty simple. So first, we want to choose a five-digit number starting with the two and write it in a piece of paper and keep it in the view of the audience. Let's say we choose 26538 for no reason whatsoever. But we need to make sure that the first digit is two. And also, we need to remember the last four, which in this case is 6538. Then, we choose our first number by adding the last four digits and 2. So in this case, we'll have 6538 plus 2, so 6540. I'll get to that while we add the 2. So now, it's our audience's turn. So they can choose any number they want. Let's say they choose 3714. So now we got to be careful in choosing our next number. We choose such that the sum of each digit place becomes 9. So what do I mean by that? So if they have 3714, we choose 6285, such that the sum of the two numbers becomes 9,999. So we see that each digit place adds up to being 9. 3 plus 6, 7 plus 2, 1 plus 8, and 4 plus 5. Then it's their turn again. So let's say they choose 1395. So our choice will be 8604. Again, it's the same idea to make 9999. We see that the digits again add up to being 9. So why do we want to do that? So till now, we have added 9,999 twice. So we are two short of 20,000, which we compensated by adding to our first number. 
So let's do a quick summary of what we have so far. The so first number we chose was 6540. Then it was our audience's turn and they chose 3714. Again, we chose 6285. And they chose 1395. And our last choice was 8604. So when we want to find the sum, let's first break it down for each individual part. So the first number is actually the sum of the last four digits of our prediction plus two. The second and the third number add up to be 9,999. Similarly, the fourth and the fifth number add up to be 9,999 again. So when we sum up, it's actually 20,000 plus 6,538 add up to be 26538, which is our prediction. So some pointers in doing this trick. What to do if they give you a digit like 9999? Ideally, we would have to choose 0000, but that would actually spoil the trick. So in that case, just be cool and tell them to make it difficult for you and give some random numbers and not just repetitions. Also, this trick can be performed in certain variations. Let's say you want to perform this trick with five digit numbers. So in that case, your initial prediction will have to be a six digit number starting with a two. For example, let's say 276394. The rest of the ideas still stays the same. We're going to add five nines twice in this case, and for the last five digits, which is 76394, we're going to add two so our first number will be 76396. And the remaining two will just manage depending on what our audience give us. So let's say you can also do this trick by increasing the quantity of numbers. So if you want three numbers from the audience, that would make a total of seven. We need to predict a five-digit number starting with a 3 instead of a 2. And our first number will be last four digits plus 3 instead of 2. Why? Because the idea is we're adding 9,999 three times, so we are 3 short of 30,000, which we compensate by adding to the first number. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, Please subscribe.